In this question, we have to decide what happens to the wavelength and the angle that the light ray makes with the normal when light passes from air to water. I wrote down a key concept that we will use to solve this question. This is that water is more optically dense than air, which means that light slows down as it passes from air to water. First, let's look at what happens to the wavelength by using this equation from subtopic 4.2, where C is the speed of the wave, F is the frequency, and lambda is the wavelength. As we have seen, the speed of light in water is lower. When a wave passes from one medium to another, its frequency doesn't change, so in our equation, F remains the same. Since C on the left side of the equation is lower and F on the right side remains the same, we can conclude that lambda, the wavelength, decreases. Let's look at the angle by using this equation from subtopic 4.4, where theta 2 is the angle that the ray makes with the normal in water, and theta 1 is the angle that the ray makes with the normal in air, V2 is the speed of light in water, and V1 is the speed of light in air. We have deduced that V2 is smaller than V1, which means that by looking at the equation, we can deduce that sine theta 2 is less than sine theta 1, which in turn means that theta 2 is less than theta 1. Let's represent this on our diagram and conclude that the answer to this question is D.